Okay, we're live. Go ahead and everybody draw four cards and good luck. Yay. Yeah, that would that would be a dick thing to do in just the regular deck. Have a card that says draw one fumble card because Logan doesn't like you. <laughs> You're just sitting there reading a book, all of a sudden you fucking stab yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of like that idea now that I say it. Hmm. Yeah, that's what I was wondering if he added any cards to the main deck. Or, you know, you fumble. <laughs> uh, I, I, I have not added those, but uh, be sure to keep an eye on the cards because I've reworded some of them uh, and actually made some of them better or tried to at least for more clarity in what's going on. Okay. So. I got pick one lock. <laughs> that could have been handy uh, a while back. <laughs> uh, it'll be interesting to see what you guys end up doing today. <laughs> Because honestly, I got no clue. Right. Uh, you guys emerge uh, reluctantly uh, from uh, a uh, old crate that's been converted into a, a kind of a shanty house near the fishmongers of the port gate of Gothic City. Apparently, the rent that you'd paid uh, for the air place has run out, Russ. Oh, already? Hey, apparently time slips by and shit. Owning a place is your best bet. You've got to look into that sometime, you're thinking. Yeah, okay. But, yeah, you guys all smell like fish, and uh, I'm, I'm not sure uh, what kind of clothes you're dressed in. I know Alex is probably wearing dark glasses right now. Like he's a uh, hobo rock star. Um, yeah. Yeah, I got my specs on. Yep, yep. You got your specs on. Jeremy, you're the only guy who doesn't look like he's a pimp. Ah. I didn't know. Yeah. So good for you. <laughs> good for you not being a pimp. Um, so, yeah, that's that's where you guys currently are. Good luck. Okay. Oh, I must have been a real bender last night. Don't normally <laughs> wake up in fish crates. <laughs> Tell me about it. So, what's well, going on with you? I think we're in the Gothic zone. You totally are, and there's there's uh, people going. Wanted people of strong sword arm, people who are brave, people who are fearless. That's me. Yeah. Right this way, sir. Okay. Oh, uh, what do you think? I follow. Uh, I think I think we got a I think we got a hook. Oh well, there's there, there's so many hooks going on that I've got people pretty much diving at other people's legs to try to get them into stuff. Um, yeah, they they want to take you. Hold on, let me find it real quick here because I knew the hook, but I don't know where it is. Uh, this is to go kraken hunting. Oh, yeah, it's fun! Oh yeah, absolutely. The krakens have been messing up the uh, the shipping between here and the New World, so they have you uh, report to. Ah. Let's see. What the fuck is this asshole's name? Boldface, your fucking name in here. Ah, there it is. Captain Kerrigan uh, at his ship, the Audacity. I like it. Unless, unless you guys are wanting to do something else. I'm just saying this is one of many things going on in the world. Right, we're going to grab it and hump it into submission. The, I, the, I like it. The, the pay is 20 silver pieces per week, plus room and board on the ship, plus a large bonus if you kill the Kraken and bring the body back. Hmm. Gotcha. 
Sounds good. I don't care about the money, just the fame. <laughs> well, the you get told by uh, the Captain Kerrigan, if it's fame you're after, then there's only one way to do it. And whiskey. Yeah. What? Uh, I, instead of the 20 copper uh, silver, I want whiskey instead. How about rum? It's a ship. Eh, Good it's alcohol. <laughs> but for real fame, you'd have to find old Mergol, the ancient Kraken, but he is too he is. dangerous. <laughs> what? <laughs> get on the ship. I think we'll get along fine. You'll be dining with me tonight. Arr. We'll engage in sodomy and the lash. It'll be fun. So, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> right. Uh, you guys uh, get on the ship. Now, if you guys would like to support Alex's luck roll, because essentially it comes down to you guys are going to be sailing around a lot. And now, Alex, if you're going for the overly over-the-top danger as opposed to a normal Kraken, normal Kraken will get you a bonus. But if you're looking for the fame, then you're yep. going to be hunting for the super hard-to-find ancient huge kraken that they're not looking for the ship does not want to find that one because he's too fucking powerful for them I but that one i see okay so <laughs> if you guys want to support alex first before he goes on luck roll <laughs> like no we don't want to support him <laughs> uh, support will be uh, luck roll at full but alex is going to be going for a luck roll at negative 30 because this is an elusive but huge kraken uh -huh. all right i'm supporting all right, I'm supporting too. Success. Success. Wow. Not wow. quite a crit. Okay. So <laughs> plus Almost 10. a crit. Plus 10 to my considerable luck already is uh, right. So Here you're minus, minus 20 total off your considerable luck because you're going for a luck yep. negative 30? Okay. Good luck. 70 or less. Ding! <laughs> you guys sail out and after like a couple of days you find a huge 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 kraken unfortunately it's way too big unfortunately everybody on the ship is blind to this and crazed by money even if you were able to kill this thing you're thinking it may drag the boat down if you tie on to it but um <laughs> alex thinks this is fucking wonderful so we immediately launch into your dramatic combat. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> of the blisters. Of the blisters. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. If, if you're wanting, you can you can definitely man your own ballista, and you'll have a loading team and shit. So you're firing pretty much once every third round. But uh, let's see. We're going to go into dramatic combat. and oh, Men. Men, steal yourselves. Have your courage built up with alcohol for tonight <laughs> we dine in hell. Excellent. Give me a leadership role. This yes. may rally the troops. I have leadership. Oh. You're rolling a D20, Matt. Try again. Ah, God damn it. Oh, well, he did oh, that for you a D20 too. on the last one, too. You better reroll your luck roll. I concur. All right. Still, you need the 70 or less to find the huge thing. Go yep. for that first. Right. Okay, right. that's good. We found it. Like no, 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 no leadership. Or unlikely leadership. Do you, do you have massive leadership? <laughs> no. That, that I have not been using much lately. <laughs> I wonder <laughs> why. <laughs> all right, the first round, villains at first and all their magic points come back. Freaking out is approved. Hmm. Hmm. This thing doesn't require Sandy Roll, but I'm here to tell you that you may get to experience the death penalty. Two of you for the first time, Alex for the second. We'll see how it works. <laughs> so uh, each of you guys do a luck roll to see if you are personally attacked by one of the six different huge tentacles. Not me. Cool. Looks like it's me, uh, but I made my luck roll. If you make it, you're not attacked. There's lots of other sailors, and of course, it's going to crush the fuck out of the ship. Good times. Oh, yes. <laughs> no problem. Uh, and please make me know if there's any explosions on the ship, Logan. I will play appropriate cards. 
Got it. No problem. It, it's essentially this round, it comes out and the big tentacles come up and it's like, Bleh! and people are like, ah, and they're freaking out, some screaming and shit. Um, <laughs> there's also uh, various other guys who are uh, fairly shitty at combat, but are trying real hard. And I know how much damage they're going to be doing. So, um, essentially, uh, every, every round, they are going to be doing about five points of damage on average to a tentacle. <laughs> so it mostly, as always, comes down to you guys because they're the wrong people for this. The captain is doing captainy things. Mm -hmm. So, uh, right, it goes first. It prepares to grab the ship this round. Your guys' turn. Uh, it has eyes, two of them, but they're smallish and harder to hit. Um, and then it also has, uh, tentacles. You can see, you can see the body, but it looks fucking immense. It's like attacking a hill. I can so. see my ballista skill again. Nice. <laughs> Sorry, let's, let's start with Jeremy. Jeremy, what do you do? I want to blur his vision. Ooh. Wow. That's a great idea. I like it. Get yeah. some. I'm gonna. I have spell casting plus twenty. Playing that. And At last, roll. you're able to use a fucking spell. <laughs> this may be the first time you've used a spell in combat. And I fail. <laughs> wah, wah. Okay, and then to Matt. Um, I will try and shoot it in the eye. I had such high hopes for Jeremy as well. All right, Matt, <laughs> uh, you're at a negative 30 to hit because this is a cold shot and it's a small target. Okay. It looks at you. And you go. And Tum. I go. Dun, 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 dun. No. All right. You fire off. Uh, did Would you have made it if you weren't at a negative 30? No. All right. You managed to miss the fucking hill-sized creature and just kind of boom. And they begin to reload. Like I said, reload is two rounds on this thing. Um, mm -hmm. I'm cranking it back and shit. Russ, what are you up to? I'm going to whip out my fire pistol and make it work. All right, give me a fast draw pistol and then mark off if you make that. That is a fail on the fast draw, so I just whip it out gradually. Excellent. No problem. You do a slow, dramatic thing next round. Villains are first telling the GM what a great adventure it is, as opposed to having your character act at all, and sounding sincere, is approved. Right, this round, the Kraken attempts to uh, constrict its tentacles around the ship. Uh, it flails its tentacles. <laughs> fumble deck, fumble <laughs> deck. Yeah, yes. yeah, it is the fumble deck time. Let's see what happens here. It's going to kill itself. <laughs> Let's see. Defend only. Whatever you are doing has gone horribly wrong. You can only defend and simple free action if wished on your next turn. You guys get a hell of a reprieve. Thanks for reminding me of the fumble deck, Russ. Take a card I'd forgotten, literally. Um, so next round, it looks like you guys have gotten a bit of a reprieve. So uh, we going, get to go this oh, yeah, I was going to say, going over to Jeremy. Jeremy, uh, what do you do this round? Uh... I will attempt to shoot it with, an obelis with a ballista. And All right. You knock sucks. aside a sailor who was like lining it up, and you're like, oh, I've got this. <laughs> uh, are any particular target? If you want to just shoot the body, you're at a plus 30 because it's fucking huge. Just the body because I suck. All so right. That's sure. a hit, though. Okay. Uh, let's see. Ballista. Let me look on my fucking damage thing because PCs don't normally use ballista. <laughs> That's heavy weapon uh, ballista, I think, for the skill. Uh, we'll do the same as a heavy shotgun. How's that? D6 plus D8. All right. D6 and D8. So 11. You do the equivalent of scratching the paint. Make a note that you've done 11 points of damage to its body. So... <laughs> Because uh, different shit on creature of this size, all different hit points. Matt, 
They are reloading the ballista right now. This is round one of reloading. What do you do? Oh, Logan, this is a, such a fantastic mission. So <laughs> glad I came now. <laughs> Go ahead and take a card. Russ, what do you do? Uh, make the pistol work. Excellent. It goes... No, actually, it's a silenced pistol, so it doesn't. Oh, you have the illegal silenced variety used in the midst of other people. Yep. Cool. <laughs> they don't notice because there's a kraken. It's huge <laughs> and scary. So, um, no problem. We now go to next round in which the kraken will be defending. It doesn't defend. Uh, so, villains are first. They menace the ship. Cross-examining uh, NPC is approved. So, uh, right, starting off with Jeremy. Um, I swear at it. I got nothing better to do. Are there other ballistas? Uh, no, not really. You got to wait for yours to get real. I mean, other people are like hitting it with boat hooks and ineffectual shit or chopping at tentacles or oh, running actually, around. I'll, I'll chop at some tentacles. I, Go I draw for my it. Sword. I quick draw my sword. Good luck. Yes. I chop at some tentacles. Okay. And that's a fail. You flail around wildly, Adam. And uh, Matt. Logan, well, they're, they're still reloading this round, right? This is round two of reloading. Yes. Can I then use this round to take aim to give me a plus percentage to shoot next time? Yes. Cool. I'll do that, please. Russ. Uh, I play a haste card, and then I take two shots at the eyes. Pew, pew. Cool. Uh, give me two pistols at negative 30, as they are small, and it's a called shot. Uh, that is a fail. And that is a success. Nice. Excellent. Uh, we'll call it the left eye unless you have a strong preference for the right. Oh, uh, left is nice. Yes, okay. All right. Go ahead and roll some damage. I shoot the labor party. Um, let's D10 unless I'm nine points to the eye. Ooh, no problem. Please keep track. Nice. Left eye, nine points. It's still functional. These have a lot of hit points. This whole thing has a lot of hit points. <laughs> but there's no armor on the eye. Good deal. So, uh, right, we now go to next round, wherein the creature finally gets to go. I'm surprised you gave up blinding it so quick, sir. Well, my Still blind sucks. What? My blind sucks. I only got an 18 in it. Oh, you haven't been practicing. I see. <laughs> Villains are first, heroes are second, and hindered. Mm-hmm. Can you swim? Attack is approved. The bad guy attempts to grab the ship with his tentacles. Bum, bum, oh, er bum, sorry. Bum. Everybody give me a luck roll to see if you are personally crushed to death by a tentacle, please. Just make a full luck roll in your Yeah, fine. Six and a quarter. Okay. And no worries. Right. The thing attempts to grab the ship. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So it's having problems. It doesn't get the large size creature because it is the large size creature. So now it's up to the PCs and the attack is approved. Starting with Jeremy, what do you do? Uh, my ballista is still reloading. Ba -ba -ba. I will... Yeah, you fired one it. round after that, so... Hacking is useless. I'm, I'm just going to cast Blurred Vision on him. All right, go for it. It's a time Bumble! To That's Bumble. never happening again. Bumble! No. Bumble that! Yay! <laughs> and you lose full magic points and no more blurring for the rest of the day. <laughs> Correct. Okay. Whatever you have done has left you wide open. Anyone and everyone wanting to attack you either this round if they haven't gone yet, or in this case, next round is at a plus thirty percent to hit you. You is go, tell me for next <laughs> round. All right. Is that no. just pretty much a minus thirty to my luck, essentially? Yes. Yes. Okay. In this case, that'd be fine. So, um, right now, we're going over to Matt, who's got the ballista. He's been aiming it. You're. What are you? What is your your ten percent less of a penalty if you're shooting a called shot? Yeah. Or 10% bonus if you're shooting okay. it like and, the body. And I play a skill five. 
Okay, so you're you're uh, plus fifteen. Where are you shooting at? What is your target? The left eye. Very good. And so you're negative fifteen percent total then, because normally negative thirty plus ten plus five. Yes. Go team. Okay. Yes. All right. <laughs> no. You need uh, how much was done before I, nine? I, I, nine. I'm using a plus ten uh, d t ten damage as well. Okay, nice. you, need a, you need 11 points total to put that eye out. Good luck. Uh, I can oh, limit retrieve that and trade it back to you if you want to use two of them in one turn. No, Fuck that's sick. Not, that's not okay. waste that. That's a good card. Right. I think I should be able to do enough with this. So D6. Nice. D8, oh, yeah. D10. 11. 11. It's hey! The left eye is put out. It's really pissed. Its right eye focuses in on it, the person who did this. <laughs> who laughs at it. Russ, it's your turn. I'm going to try and put out that right eye. Oh, good luck. Excellent. Oh, no. Uh, no problem. Let's check the fumble deck to see what kind of fun Wait, this hold is. Wait, hold it. Can I, can, I, uh, can I conviction the fumble before? I'm going to pause a fumble before I pick the fumble deck. Of course, if you want to, but the fumble deck's not that bad. All right, fuck it. Fumble deck. Lose all actions. You've managed to mess up so badly that next round you can't do anything. Can't attack, can't defend, can't simple action. Naturally, this puts everyone at a plus 30 to ha hit you. You just stand there I looking card? stupid. It's a bad day. What? <laughs> and can I card war next round, or is that, is that also disabled? Um, if, if, it's, if it's something kind of meta, you could... Or if it's something like dropping something, you could. So on certain things, maybe. Otherwise, you just stand there going, "Well, fuck." <laughs> All right. So you're uh, both you and uh, Jeremy are are not uh, are you're at a minus thirty on your luck roll just for next round getting crushed by tentacles. We go to next round as Alex waits for his ballista to get reloaded so he can take out the other eye. Villains are first, heroes are second, nothing is approved. So no card worry for Russ. So uh, Russ and Jeremy, you're at negative 30 on your luck roll. Matt, you too, because it knows who did that. It does not like you. Uh-huh. Oh, fail. I'm pausing that. And I fail still. Hooray. Well, I pause, but at least it, I didn't It ignores fall. the guy who partially blinded it and goes for oh, the yeah. other two. <laughs> That's negative 60. <laughs> Got it. So did Jeremy and Russ both fail their luck roll? Yeah. Yes. Nice. At last, it gets an attempt to crush somebody. And we'll fumble both. <laughs> Quite possibly. All right. Let me look at its uh, uh, armor. No. Oh, please fumble. Fumble deck. Fumble deck. <laughs> okay. Uh it goes for grappling each of you so that it can lift you into the air and squeeze the fuck out of you every round. So, first on Jeremy. <laughs> and then we'll, we'll skip over to Russ. Okay, it wildly misses. And then it's generally trying to grab the ship because it has several attacks. God damn it. All right, so the only thing it does this round is it hits the fumble deck, the huge, scary behemoth. <laughs> oh, that bonus. Whatever you've done has left you wide open. Uh, basically, you guys, next round, are all at a plus 30% to hit this thing. So for Ah, uh, motherfucker. I have to put you at zero. Yeah, but the ballista's not f ready My yet. My ballista's ready. Correct. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> give me, give me, give me, give me. You have a better ballista skill than I do. It makes sense. I do. <laughs> Go for it. All so right. Jeremy backs away. Matt Simple's <laughs> actions over to his ballista. But first, I need to flip the round card, which says, heroes are amazingly first. Throwing something is approved. So <laughs> we'll first go Jeremy. Jeremy, you've simple action away from your ballista. I, and... I pick up a bottle of rum and throw it and throw it at the squid. Not the rum! <laughs> 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 uh, picking it up would be your first action, so it'd have to be something in your hand unless uh, you got a haste card. I, I just throw my sword at it then. You have a sword in hand? <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. Nice. He pulled that out. All right, right you're to pull it, Alex Kinley. Give me a, uh, a sword at half, or was it throw at half? I think it's throw at half. So good All luck. All right, where's my throw? All right, success. 
Wow. Oh my Christ. <laughs> and uh, damage? I, I'm guessing you were going for the eye since you were no negative to hit it, other than the sword being really unwieldy. Sure. Of course. Uh, what, uh, do you have a, a dex bonus, by the way? Is your dex mm. 80 or better? No, it's getting there, but no. Okay, so uh, normally sword damage is D8. I think you just get your D8 then. Okay. Roll a D8. As you attempt to soften up the eye a little bit. Kill this first. Hopefully. Yes! Oh, yeah. <laughs> just a little bit more than a little bit. Go ahead and take a card for throwing something. <laughs> Meanwhile, we go over to uh, Alex, who's like, not the rum at the ballista. <laughs> and he shoots it in anger. Yes! Holy okay. shit. Uh, you need at least 12 damage. I feel sorry for this fucking thing. All right, <laughs> come on. Eight, seven. Uh, here we go. No! Oh! It can still see. It's got a sword and a ballista <laughs> ball stuck on its eye. It's all up to fucking rust. How many points is that total on the eye? Eight, seven, uh, 15, 16. 16. So Four hit points left. It's all up to Russ. All right, taking Go a Russ. shot at, at full, right? Yeah, yes. because it's a, it's at wide Crit. open. Crit. <laughs> Holy this shit! This thing is just fucked. <laughs> <laughs> it takes nine more points of damage to its red oh, eye. Oh god oh, damn! Me. All right, so <laughs> Bolt is now blinded. Unfortunately, this doesn't cause it to stop attacking. It causes it to go absolutely berserk and begin flailing around wildly, but at much at, at less of a skill. So, <laughs> no, if he's going the way he's going now, yeah, he's rolling the way. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty much only a matter of time before you fucking kill it. So, uh, we go into next round as it be. Oh wait, no, he gets to go yet. It hasn't gone. Um, I'm right. It attempts to uh, what? Do you want luck rolls from us, please? Uh, yeah. <laughs> no yeah. Yes. All right. It attempts to get the ship. Bumbo. Bumbo. <laughs> <laughs> it was. It was a do it as a living. Now it's bound to hobbyist. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the captain just staring at you guys as you are fucking laughing your asses off while you're killing this thing. And the other guys are like hacking on a tentacle and they're looking back at you guys like, what's so goddamn funny? Heroes <laughs> are first, villains are second, attack is again approved, and you're first. Wow. All right. So starting off with Jeremy, uh, it has no eyes left, but it appears that. Uh, it has a lot of tentacles and, of course, the body, mm -hmm. which can is I, slightly wounded. Can I attempt to fast draw a sword from one of the other people on the boat since I Ooh. threw mine in his eye? <laughs> yeah, oh, cool. yeah I, I can see that because <laughs> there are a bunch of people with swords around, and they don't mind if you take them and you're it's, not trying to hide it, so sure. It's, it's very piratey. It is uh, very piratey. Fast draw a sword. Success. He goes, <laughs> some other guy's like, oh, <laughs> all right. And then? Uh, pack of a tentacle. Okay, great. Tentacles are easy to hit. The body is a little further away. That Unless is not a fumble, but it is not a fumble. completely insane and want to spend the round jumping. Did you say you fumbled or no? Not a fumble, but it's not a success. Damn it. Moving over to Alex, what do you do? Um, I simply action moved to my ballista, which is now loaded. And take a shot at the body. Uh, You're at a full. plus 30 to hit the body. It's nice. Huge. Bloody hell. Uh, just. Just. He's got some ballistic damage. Uh, Jeremy, you yeah, please keep track of the body hit point. Have Matt tell you about uh, that. So you were the one who injured it first. Russ, what are you up to? Ooh. Uh, pew pew. Uh, no, I put a 20. What's the target, though, Russ? That's important. The body. All right. Body's at plus 30. Tentacles are not. Uh, that's, yeah, that's a... It's, I know that's it's a hit because you're at a plus 30. There's no way to miss it with 27. All right. It takes five points of damage to its body. Fire damage. It matters. For, 
uh, for this particular creature, no. But it goes absolutely berserk. Um, everybody give me your luck roll at full. Uh, this is to keep from being a uh, accidental target as it can't see anymore. Success. Yes. Yes, everybody good? Yep. Yep. Cool. Yep. It attempts to crush the boat, but since it's blind, it's having a super rough time right now. Missed by a bit. So, mm. had it not been blind, then you would have begun experiencing the Crushinator. As it is, the deck is becoming really unstable because even though this huge thing is missing, it's creating a lot of stuff. And a lot of the sailors are going, ah, and falling around and stuff. Everybody give me a free maneuver roll. This is free just to make sure you're keeping your feet and not joining the sailors going, oh, and sliding around the deck and maybe even going off the yeah. uh, ship. I make that. Yes. You made it 87? Yes, mate. Uh, by oh, one. Damn. All right. No problem. Alex is like, I'm, I've been drunker than this. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We now go to next round. Villains are first. Nothing is approved. It attempts to crush the shit out of the ship with its flailing tentacles, missing everybody yeah. because it has no eyes. We now go to the, I wouldn't call them heroes so much as butchers. So, uh, Jeremy, <laughs> what do you do? Uh, I think we'll call can Peter. I, I'm gonna, can I, I'm gonna assist with reloading. Does that take a round off? No, no, you've got a full crew that's reloading. It, it takes physical time to crank back the, uh, the windows and shit. I don't have any ranged weapons. Are there any Robert. pistols lying around? Uh, no, no. Pistols are kind of expensive and more rare. Oh, uh, wait. Okay. Russ has one in his hand. Oh. <laughs> Pack in a tentacle. Miss. All right. And Matt. Uh, I will. What's the, what's the proof this round? Nothing. Nothing. Uh, I'll do nothing. <laughs> Round one of reloading. Russ. Another shot at the body. Success. I'm at plus 30 still. Yeah. Six more points, Jeremy. Excellent. Hold on. I'm going to close the door real quick because I can hear Matt and it's messing with my head if I hear him twice. <laughs> messing with your head. Man, D20 likes us today. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like having two mats. I just can't handle it. So, <laughs> never. we now go to next round. I need to work on a range spell. Mm -hmm. Oh, the, blind, the blur vision, until you guys actually blinded it, would have been beautiful. Uh, villains are first hitting someone with a chairs approved. Uh, it attempts to crush the fuck out of the ship. Come on, ship. God damn it. So, going over to Jeremy. Uh, I kind of want to hit someone with a chair, but I think that uh, would cause issues. <laughs> it, if it didn't, if you had a haste card, you could pick up a chair, although they don't have a lot of chairs on the deck of a ship for some guy. Yeah, reason. especially one that's rocking all over the place. Yep. So, what are you going to do? Round two of reloading. Stand and do nothing. Yeah, and over to Matt, round, two, round two round two of reloading as well, you guys uh, make the sync up. Yeah, but if when if you if unless no one's jumped back on Will's blister, they would be reloaded by now. Oh on on who on sorry, um the one Jeremy? that Phil was using. Sorry. Yes. Jeremy, Phil. Yeah. Ah. So, so I moved to his tonight, then I moved back. So they would have had two rounds by now to reload theirs. Oh, okay. So I'll jump on my ballista and fire. Oh, okay. Since I'm at a plus 30, I might as well. Go on, then. Yes, and I fail. Guess. Hooray! <laughs> Alex glares at you. And <laughs> Alex, what are you, you going to wait for your ballista? I will pay, wait patiently for my ballista to be removed. <laughs> <laughs> and over to The Rock. The Rock shoots again. And crits. Plus nice. 30, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Roll double damage. 13 points to the body. Nice. Jeremy. How many charges do you have left on your gun there? 
18. That is the way to fucking answer that question. Instantly <laughs> and without looking. Otherwise, we all know the answer. So we now go to next round as the rock bravely helps slaughter the helpless creature. <laughs> oh, I know. I can, I can imagine all the, all, the, all the crewmen now are just going, oh, this is just, this is not right. <laughs> it feels so no, sorry. No, a couple of them have just stopped and are staring, dumbfounded. Uh, <laughs> others are bravely struggling with their tentacles and shit. Heroes are first. Reloading is approved. Throwing a weapon is approved. Mm. Um, if you've got one in hand. Like, Worked pretty well for me last time. Shit. So, uh, going going down the list. Jeremy, what do you do? I throw my sword at him. Aha! He says, flinging an iron sword like some watery tart attempting to figure out who the next king should be. Plus 30, cut in half. That's a success. Great. And go ahead and uh, roll some damage. Uh, where my, is my DK? My father's sword, says a random sailor. Three damage. <laughs> All right. And... Uh, let me know when you get into triple digit damage, would you? And right. over, <laughs> over to uh, Alex Kinley. Your ballista is finally Boink. loaded. Some guy's shining it up, and you fire. He goes, oh! Seven more damage. And back over to The Rock, who brought a gun to a gunfight and is happier for it. <laughs> All right. Here we go again. That's a hit. He's just sitting there basically holding on to some rigging and going pew, pew, and it's going zap, 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 zap. <laughs> Ten points. Nice. Jesus. How much is it up to total? We are at 57. It looks pretty wounded. There's fucking blood and viscera coming out of it. It's gone berserk because it's got no fucking eyes and so it's kind of in its death throes trying to crush the fuck out of the ship. The captain's freaking out, but there's not a lot he can do because all the boiling water is just tossing the ship around. Some of the sailors are just holding on to shit. Other ones are bravely hacking the tentacles and shit. One of the tentacles has fallen off this round. Uh, it's still got lots of them. And uh, the captain's looking at you guys who are all laughing and going, yeah, this is great. This is what I'm for. <laughs> so now we go to... Next round. Well, they did come for fame, says the captain to himself. Villains are first, heroes are second, and cannot use magic. Throwing or dropping something currently held is approved. Aww. Aww. <laughs> so, villain goes first. It attempts to crush the fuck out of the boat. Come on. Bum, bo, bum, bo, bum, bo. Oh, if it only was at its original skill. So, yeah. I Sorry for you. I didn't expect you guys to be able to shoot out two twenty hit point eyes. Yeah, at negatives. So going down the list, we got Jeremy. Uh, I draw another sword so that I have something in my hand. Right. Uh, give me a luck roll of negative thirty because the other sailors are kind of using theirs or trying to move away from you. Like, no, no, I I bought this sword. And you're like, damn oh, it. Bitches. They keep there are no swords nearby. They're, they're yeah. on to you. <laughs> Apparently, you just draw them and throw them into the ocean, so they're not at all interested in losing their fucking expensive weapon. Uh, you spend the round running after sailors and trying to get their swords, and they spend okay. their time running away from you. Sounds good. Matt, what do you do? I quick draw my magic sword from its pocket. Shing! He pulls out a big, glowing, rune-encrusted, two-handed sword and goes, ah! <laughs> and the, two, the, uh, the four guys who are working in Ballista team look at him like, oh, no. It's tentacle time. <laughs> <laughs> um, they're like, but it's, it, it looks like you're really doing good work. <laughs> oh, by the way, Jeremy, uh, here and there are belaying pins. They're kind of smallish clubs and stuff if you just need a weapon. Okay. Okay. You can pick up one next round at a boat near you. And over to Russ. Uh, uh, I take it you're not using magic includes not using a magic tech pistol? Yes. Okay. Sorry. Uh, I forgot Alex. Yeah. Um, oh, quick, George. So I, yeah. I wanted, oh, yeah. That's right. You quick, George. Yeah. Pack up one of the tent schools. I was going to say, if you wanted to, you could instead, it's about close enough, although if you fail, it would be bad. There's enough rents and bolts and stuff that it's possible if you were to make a jump at negative 30, you could hit right near where the 
eyes used to be in the brain pan and shit, but it's super risky. The tentacles are much safer. I like it. <laughs> Give me yeah. a jump at negative 30. Yes. He bounced over there. Right here on this round. The thing is not at well pleased. Sorry. Okay, back to Russ. Okay, uh, what's approved this round? Throwing or dropping your pistol. Uh, well, I just curse that my magic tech pistol isn't working. Excellent. And next round. Here we are. Heroes are first. Everybody mark off a legitimate piece of gear and tell me what it was. If it's not a useful piece of gear, the GM will select something much, much I will worse. knock off one of my nine decoder rings. Ah, fair enough. That's a magic item. Lighting someone on fire is approved, by the way. Ooh. Jeremy, what are you getting rid of? Super glue. That's really all I got. <laughs> you have nothing else on you? Seriously? Because you've never even used super glue. It's never actually come up. I stole it from the doc at one point in time. <clears throat> That's really all I got. I've just been hopping between the school where I don't really have anything. Gave up yep. the gun I got in the school. I had lock picks and super glue. Lock picks. All right. Russ. Um, was, is one of the brown, brown um, AI's crystals sufficient? Yeah, it is a magic item. It's gone. Cool. And right. So, heroes are first, starting with Jeremy. I pick up a ballista since no one wants to have let me have any uh, guns or, or anything stabby. Uh, you go over to man Alex's ballista, which is it reloaded yet or not yet? I don't want to. I don't want to man the gun. I want one of the big arrows. That's what I meant. Sorry. Oh, sorry. A bolt. Got a it. Bolt. Pick up a ballista bolt. These are easy to get. Okay, over to Alex. What do you do? Chop. Crit. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Crit. Crit with the swords. Is uh, this where your brain is? He asks. <laughs> and martial arts swords. Got it. But nothing special. Oh shit! So how do I work this out? Uh, what's oh. your what's your normal damage? D twelve. Okay. Uh, and plus strength bonus plus martial arts. Okay, so, hold on, man. Let me let me look at the fucking chart. So it's D twelve, and plus martial arts is D six plus D eight plus the what? Strength, strength. bonus. Uh, so two D eight, and then you got crit. So it's so that's four D eight. <laughs> <laughs> so 22 damage <laughs> <laughs> all right he begins just levering his sword slowly into its brain and <laughs> twisting back and forth on the fucking uh pommel guards he's like <laughs> and the captain he just shows a close-up of the captain going <laughs> <laughs> okay, look at me, man. Look at me. Someone take a picture. <laughs> <laughs> that was a posing uh, for a selfie. <laughs> you know, over to uh, Russ. What are you going to do? Uh, the predictable open fire. Oh, shit. Yeah. It's a plus 30, right? Uh, yes. Uh, actually, no, it's down to plus 20 because Alex is there. But if you would have made it at a plus 30, but not at a plus 20. Then you're in that narrow band called Alex Kinley's body. Man. I would have made it at a plus 30. Would I you don't make it at a plus 20. You do not? Nope. So you shoot Alex. Good deal. He was getting too big for his bridges anyway. Roll some damage. Alex, you take four points. I'll take it. <laughs> Pew! He <got> ah. <laughs> Right, it could be your uh, gaming hip going again. You're just not sure. It'll this be round, round. It'll be fine creature. in four rounds. Huh? It'll be fine in four rounds. No problem. This <laughs> round, uh, the creature attempts to squash Alex Kinley with one of its tentacles. Because... <laughs> oh, Stop it's... hitting yourself. Stop it's... hitting oh, yourself. It might. It's got a. It's got a twenty percent. So it fumbles on ninety-two or better. Here Come we go. On. Oh, <laughs> oh, almost a crit. I will you use a pause on that. Are you sure you don't want to know the damage first? Nope. Okay. And 
<laughs> no problem. And then uh, I'm going to go for the ship. No, of course not. It flails around like a helpless, like the helpless fucking sea creature it is. It, it flails around as though you've got it prisoned on dry land. <laughs> it, it's like a whale, and you guys are like the Japanese right now, okay? <laughs> <laughs> so, moving over to Russ. I'm sorry to all the Japanese listeners oh, out there. Sorry, Russ has already gotten. Go I already went this round, yeah. All right. Uh, Our Japanese fan base is outraged, but by God, they love the whale. So, uh, <laughs> heroes are first. Nothing is approved. This is the best. I'm waiting for our heroes fully regenerate uh, hit points or something like that, but I haven't got any of that uh, shit for the villains yet. So, heroes are first. Nothing's approved. Start with Jeremy. Oh, sorry. I forgot to mention as well, uh, when this, when Ross shot me, shot me, I forgot about my two natural armor. So... Ah. In two rounds, that'll be better. In fact, in one round, it'll be better now. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. You watch the small hole you put in, Alex, going... <laughs> nice. Yeah. Nice. He is a freak of fucking nature. So, yeah. starting with Jeremy, what do you do? Ballista shot. Since... No problem. Now, same deal. It, you're at a plus 30, or sorry, plus 20, but if you would have made it a plus 30, but not a plus 20, then it's Alex time. Right Where there. is the point scale. of fun for Logan? Oh, we'll it's fun, isn't it? Damn it. Oh, plus 20. It's a success. Oh, nice. A, another oh, handhold appears near Alex. He goes, mm. ah. <laughs> D8, D6. Four damage. Nice. That's full. Uh, uh, skipping Alex because I don't know what kind of shit he's going to do to it. Let's go over to <laughs> Rush shooting it real quick. <laughs> Hit. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm getting into smaller damage before we get into craziness again. That's right? just a whiff. One. Okay, back to Claymore landmine damage, guy. It, it um, might not be. I have to be uh, in close range, though, so I've had to take a, a leap sir, of faith. Sir, a 2d8 leap of faith. is Claymore damage. You <laughs> do 2d8 per swing. Fuck yeah. you. You're, you're Claymore. Well, only if he makes right. his martial arts. That's true. Right. Okay. So I make my sword. Uh -huh. Uh, I don't think I make martial arts. So no, D eight plus make... D six. D eight plus D six. Yep. Almost clean more damage. Ballista damage. There you go. Eight more points. Plus I go push the sword in even more. We're almost three we digits, guys. We're at ninety two. God oh, damn, this thing looks really fucking bad. It's got huge rents in it. It's on its last gasp. The sailors are are beginning to let up a cheer. And we go to the bad guy going. I almost forgot that poor bastard. He goes for his uh he goes for the Alex Kinley, 20 or less again. Crit. God damn it. <laughs> he squishes <laughs> Alex like a bug and wipes him rolling, off. Why were you rolling this against no, maybe it's not a good thing. Uh, I, I will so. I will I will pause that one as well. Are you sure uh, you don't want to go for the damage? Uh, it will instant death. No, thank you. All right. <laughs> he might hammer the sword further into his brain, killing himself. In, in the process of killing me. <laughs> I don't know. All right, so now against the boat. Now. <laughs> he just hates me. Hates yes. me so much. The poor it's hapless Kraken. It's understandable. I'm jamming a sword into its brain. Yeah. Heroes are first that may not use cards. Maneuver is approved. If you want to maneuver around the ship deck, you can. Um, so, uh, going down, uh, kind of going down the list. Jeremy, what do you do? Can I maneuver to the other ballista and take a shot? No, because you can't use You can maneuver to the other ballista this round and get a card if you make it. I'm going to maneuver to the other ballista. Or you can simple action and actually get a shot off, Jeremy. Yeah, either way. Uh, I want a card. Okay, <laughs> maneuver your ass over there. Give me a card. <laughs> I got a card. Go for it. I'm moving, I'm moving over to the other ballista. That's it. Yes, yes. Go for it. I did. 31. Oh, That's good. It. You get a card. Russ, what do you do? I'm going to shoot this thing before it gets a goddamn full heal. Okay. That is... Shooting Alex in the back? <laughs> Shooting Alex in the back. Yay! Nice. Roll some damage. Nine points, Alex. Yeah, I'll take it. Ah, he says... Son of a bitch! <laughs> Is this what you call motivation? <laughs> Suck it up, bitch. Alex, go for it. 
<laughs> that's not a crit, unfortunately, on the martial arts, but still. Two D eight. Oh yeah. <laughs> Twelve damage. Twelve more damage. We are triple digits. One hundred and four. It fucking dies ugly. <laughs> now, uh, the the does anybody have a uh, knot tying or uh, wailing skill or something like that? I have knot tying. knot tying. Give me knot tying rolls to help get this thing bound up. They're using Alex to help chop off the tentacles because the whole thing would just weigh too much. So they're trying to bring the body back as proof. I got my knot tying. God damn it. I don't think I have it either because it's a write-in. Of course it's a write-in. There are so many fucking write-ins. I'm not so going to in? untie his knot by mistake, so I just stand and watch. Cool. Cool. No problem. Uh, yeah, he pretty much has to uh, 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 tie up the knots, chop off the tentacles. Pretty much they just make him do most of the work. Uh, many of the crew are cheering. Um uh, and uh, as as they're cheering for for Alex and stuff, uh, guy sidles up next to Rock and goes, "Let me guess. If you shoot him in the back, it makes him angry, and then he does more. <laughs> he's more hurty. Is that how it works? <laughs> Pretty much. If you get something off that big, it'll kill you. <laughs> oh god." I, I don't stop giving him ideas. And I blow into my pistol. <laughs> he says, well, it's a legal pistol. <laughs> yeah. He says, he says, I used to have something similar. I'd have somebody slap my ass while I was fucking. <laughs> All right. I don't know what to make of that. So I just kind of walk away. I sidle away from the guy very carefully. Yeah. He says, I'm not yeah. getting a date today. So, um, <laughs> Right. Uh, the captain attempts his sail ship roll to he, the reason he has to actually roll it. And he's very good at this, but he's still going to sink and take you guys all down with him because you're too far yeah, away. Great, out. That would be a great ending. That would if, be a fucked up quit, death. If you quit this, I would be fucking so happy. Oh, all, yeah. All your if I fumble it, you'll be delighted too because then you'll get to experience a new life under the sea. So... <laughs> Up to the sea. So uh, here, here goes. Hey, he's at seventy skill. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Great. Uh -huh. <laughs> you guys get uh, back into the docks and stuff with your huge prize. Uh, there's all kinds of fucking cheering. Uh, people couldn't, cannot believe that old Marigold was uh, uh, killed. The, uh, enough of the sailors saw what happened that, you know, you guys are all considered good, but the guy who fucking leapt on its back and started burying his sword into its brain and laughing the whole time, uh, he, he gets hoisted up and stuff. Don't forget about the rum. And, yeah. Um, right. And so, uh, one of them goes, uh, obviously, uh, he talks to Jeremy, he's like, so he doesn't want any money. Just whiskey or rum, booze in general. Right. Uh, Alex, you have a literal wagon with a horse. They, I don't know if you know how to operate, but the wagon is full yeah. of alcohol. Good. Uh, yes. Whiskey, rum, etc. cetera. And uh, for each of you other guys, yeah, because the captain, captain wouldn't have felt right about it. Ah, wow, Jesus. Each, uh, uh, Jeremy and uh, uh, The Rock, you guys each get 2,000 silver pieces. Holy shit. Oh, yeah. It, it is, it's pretty much a, a huge bonus for bringing back uh, a Kraken. But since you brought back uh, Old Marigold, uh, yeah, it's fame as well. You guys are uh, the toast of the town. Um, yeah. Uh, which, you know, is kind of awkward, but, yeah. I, I look at my money and my week's pay. I, I hold out my hand to the coach or guy going in my week's pay. <laughs> Here's your 20 silver. He says. <laughs> I just smile. Can I have Thank that you. gold, please? Um, yeah. You, you I, I go, 
I go, my week's pay, and I just to the half bottle drunk won't rum in his hand. <laughs> <laughs> he hands it to you. He's like, you bastard. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Russ, go ahead and divide up the the um, uh, money because uh, uh, seventy silver pieces is gold. Yeah, I did that already. Great. Yeah, yeah they, they pay you in that. So you guys have a lot of heavy metal. All right. So I got twenty eight pieces of gold. Yeah. Nice. Heavy metal. Nicely <laughs> done, um, Alex. Yeah. Last time I talked to the great Yan Liu, and he wanted us to check out the Shadow Spire Point outpost. Who the hell is the great Yan Liu? Well, he's a he's a fabulous. You know, I'm not exactly sure. Uh, Glenn introduced me to him. Yeah. Do we buy a house since we're rich? That's probably oh. a really take a card there, yes. uh, Phil. Clever. Who needs houses when you have crates? <laughs> mm. I will miss the crate. You, you know, you could probably pick it up and move it into your new house. Which <laughs> I might uh, just do that. They also sell a lot of weird shit here. Like, you can buy bicycles and shit like that here, but as far as housing goes, oh, and if you can ever get some more guns and shit. Nobody says shit about uh, uh, the Rock's gun, obviously. Partially because they don't want the rock to shoot them. Partially because they don't want Alex to fucking stab them with the fucking Kraken sword. He's my personal motivator. <laughs> yeah, they don't want the. Let's see, a simple house. Uh, you're looking at uh, fourteen thousand for that. Um, more if it's good location inside the wall, etc. If you want it in a swamp, then you get it for seven thousand. 7,000 silver. Mm -hmm. So more than you've got currently, I believe. Damn. Yep. Yeah. Houses are expensive. Yeah. Yeah. They are. <laughs> how's how's uh, financing, Logan? Is there financing in this? <laughs> no. Yeah. That's what I thought. <laughs> yeah. You think they right. give the house to the saviors of the city? Well, no, you're you're just saving some of the shipping lane and stuff. But uh, you can, for a great place to live, for a room and board uh, each, uh, getting a discount for the three of you for like a hundred silver pieces per week, uh, you could rent out a place. But the house is given how much time passes, how quickly sometimes you know you'll come back on. It's like oh, my two months of rent are gone. Yep. So, might as well save up for a house. I won't be doing that again. Save up for a house, yeah. No worries. The crate stays. Yay. Cool. Like All right. Well, back to the crate. That was <laughs> I was going to say, you, while, while you're actually in, in the world, uh, staying at a hotel or whatever will not cause you guys to have to battle your way through dumb muggers and shit who just don't seem to learn and you won't get back problems and smell like fish all the time. And plus, yeah. Alex needs a place to store a literal wagon of alcohol. That's true. <laughs> um, Logan, mm -hmm. I'd like to go check the cloakroom at the Heston. You mean the Helton? Helton, is that it? Yeah. H-E-L-T-O-N. It's like yeah. the Helton, but more hellish. Har -de -har -har. Yeah, I'd like to check the cloakroom at the Helton. Daytime, nighttime? Um, <clears throat> nighttime. There's nothing special about it. People don't seem to like to go in there. There's no gate, if that's what you were looking for. Nope. Nope, wasn't looking for a gate. Uh, I was looking for maybe notes. No. Uniforms, anything interesting here? Nope. Looks like uh, if there was anything like that, it's all been cleaned away by the cleaning staff or something. Cool. Want to stay here, guys? Nice hotel. Sure, we're already here. Probably better than the crate. Actually, just so, just so you're aware, a room at the Helton per person is 40 silver pieces per night. Oh, Ouch. maybe we will stay here. It is the second finest hotel in this town. However, this is the kind of place where uh, you have your own staff in the room. Right. 
Staff sounds nice. Oh, staff is lovely. <laughs> we'll, we'll stay you at a cheaper place. We're saving up for a house. Got to be fiscally responsive, responsible, guys. Yeah, well, right. I see. Like I said, for a really nice place, uh, you can get for, uh, with all three of you staying in a suite, 100 silver pieces per week for a pretty nice place just to rent and shit. 